we could work out the amount of metal that is used to make a can. Why don't you grab your can and do it with me? Remember that your measurements might be different to mine depending on the size of the can that you have, but the method will still be the same. We need to get the exact measurements of the can and then substitute these values into the formula we've just worked out. The formula we found for the cylinder is 2 times pi times radius squared plus 2 times pi times radius times the height. We already know that pi rounded off is 3,14. So all we need to do is find the radius of the circle and the height of the cylinder. Using a ruler, I'm going to measure from one side of the can to the other side, passing through the center. And on my can, I get 10 centimeters. The radius is half of the diameter, which means if we want to find the radius, we need to divide the diameter by 2. So with this can, the radius is therefore 5 centimeters. Now, using my ruler, let's measure the height. On my can, I get 12 centimeters. Right, now we have all the information we need to substitute into the formula. We can find the total surface area. We know that the radius is equal to 5 centimeters and the height is equal to 12 centimeters. Substituting these points in, we get area is equal to 2 times the value of pi, which is 3,14 multiplied by radius which is 5 squared plus 2 times pi which is 3,14 multiplied by the radius which is 5 multiplied by the height which is 12. So our total surface area is 533,8 centimeters squared.